kick the bass for them brothers and let them know what we're going for. Rolling stones with a rap game, not bragging. Look bigger than Jagger, not sagging. Brother backwards, I'm going to leave it at that. That ain't got nothing to do with rap. Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Hope you are all doing fantastic and are doing well. What you're about to see over the course of the next few minutes is all video footage of uh, some mountain bike riding up in the Madison, Wisconsin area that I obtained with my buddy yesterday. So we did about 15 miles of trail riding, sessioning some pretty awesome features and we probably looped five or so hours of mountain biking. So it's the day immediately after and the legs are feeling pretty sore, but it was an absolute blast of a time. Dropping in. Gotta love those squeaky brakes. There you go, man. That was good. Cleared it. Got it. Unfortunately, my derailleur is a little bit busted on the Ibis Ritmo, so that came with the Shimano Dior. 
I would like to say M8100 if I'm not mistaken. If I am, I'll add the correction up on the screen here, but unfortunately one of the jockey wheels is just completely messed up, uh, just bent beyond belief. So every time I'm shifting gears, the, the chain is getting sucked back into the actual derailleur mechanism. So basically it's time for a new derailleur. They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine. When you're not really fine, but you just can't get into it because they would never understand. Tamrock has some really cool wood stuff, some awesome doubles, and once you get over to Quarry Ridge, there's some really cool rocky kind of technical downhills, and then there's some really cool doubles, some really big tables, just all around great stuff to session, um, but there's no lack of climb. So you're going to get a workout in, you're going to get to ride some pretty awesome features, and I would wholeheartedly recommend going to both. So if you look outside here, you can see my local bike shop and they are unfortunately closed, but I will be making a trip to them pretty soon to fix that aforementioned derailleur. So hopefully they could uh, get this thing fixed up and I'll be back out on the trail soon.